Good day to everybody. The theme for lesson today is Cape to Narnia. Open your pupil's books at the 19th page and prepare your vocabularies for writing down new words. Revive these words in your vocabularies and learn them by heart. First of all, let's repeat them all together. Army. Army. Best selling. Best selling. Brave. Brave. Bull. Bull. Creature. Creature. Dangerous. Dangerous. Enemy. Enemy. Escape. Escape. Fight. Fight. Follower. Follower. Frightening. Frightening. Furry. Furry. General. General. Night. Night. Очень похож на слово ночь, поэтому будьте внимательны. Первая буква К не читается. Loyal. Loyal. Mythical. Mythical. Pick up. Pick up. Series. Series. Setting. Setting. Soldier. Soldier. Sword. Sword. Wise. Wise. Let's listen to the text and while you are listening, I'd like you to follow the text and read it yourself. Ребят, давайте послушаем текст, но пока вы его слушаете, вы должны будете следить и читать его самостоятельно. Let's listen. Escape to Narnia Welcome to the magical world of Narnia, a land of mythical creatures and talking animals. Narnia is the setting of the best-selling series of fantasy books by C.S. Lewis. Some of the books, like The Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe, are also very popular films. Many unusual creatures live in the land of Narnia. Let's meet some of them. Aslan, the Great Lion, is the creator and king of Narnia. He has magical powers and uses them for good. He is very wise and kind, but can also be quite dangerous. One of Aslan's loyal followers is Reepercheep, the talking mouse. He may look small, furry and cute, but he is a brave knight who can fight very well with a sword. Narnia has some fascinating mythical creatures too. High in the sky, griffins fly about. These magnificent creatures have the body of a lion, but the head and wings of an eagle. Griffins are soldiers in Aslan's army, along with centaurs. Centaurs are also strange creatures that are half man and half horse. They run quickly and are usually generals in Aslan's army because they are very clever. Not all creatures in Narnia are good, though. Minotaurs are enemies of Aslan. They are quite frightening creatures, with the body of a human, but the head of a bull. Minotaurs are stronger than the other animals in Narnia. Another terrifying enemy of Aslan is the talking wolf, Malgrim. As the leader of the wolves in Narnia, Malgrim can be extremely dangerous. Full of fascinating creatures, Narnia can be quite an adventurous place. Why not pick up one of C.S. Lewis's books and see for yourself? I'd like you to pause. I'd like you to pause the video and read this text yourself, not less than two times. Ребята, ну теперь поставьте видео на паузу, прочтите этот текст не менее двух раз. Have you done? Прочли? Молодцы. 
Да, я думаю, вам совсем не составит труда выполнить второе задание письменно в тетрадке. Read the text and complete the sentence. Прочтите текст и дополните предложение. The writer of Narnia is. Кто написал Нарнию? Writer, писатель. The king of Narnia is. Кто является королем? Repeat can. Что может он? Griffons can. Что могут выполнять они? Kentaurus look like. Как выглядят кентавры? Minotaurus are against. Минотавры против кого? Against. Write down your answers in your notebooks. Take photo of them and send me. Запишите ответы в тетрадку, сфотографируйте и вышлите мне. Don't forget to learn words by heart. И не забудьте выучить слова наизусть. Thank you for the lesson.